This video is going to be a demonstration of the different filter and adjustment effects uh, that exist in Pixlr Photo Editor. Uh, now a lot of these um, effects are just single click commands. It doesn't take a lot of work on your part. Uh, you just have to decide you know, which one you want to use and in a few instances uh, you're able to make some adjustments to kind of change up how that effect works. Uh, for this demonstration I'm going to be using a stock photograph from morgfile.com uh, that was provided by the username Jusbin. So we have a nice row of cars here uh, with some shadows. So what I'm going to do is come up here and go to adjustment first uh, and these first two set these first two tools uh, first one being brightness and contrast you can click on it and kind of move it out of the way so you can see what it does to your photo and then you can adjust the brightness of the photo making it darker or if you so choose make it lighter just bring it back to normal hit zero or you can adjust the contrast and Pixlr allows you to preview the changes as you make them adjust the contrast in the other direction like so and if I want to bring it back to normal I'll just hit OK uh, the next one is hue and saturation again uh, Pixlr allows you to preview these effects as you change them that would be the hue adjustment here we have saturation and if we go in the other direction it would make it black and white completely desaturated the photo. Bring it back to zero and lightness making the exposure shorter or longer and you can hit OK. Now these others um, if we look at our levels here allows you to adjust like so back to the adjustment tab and then you can invert go to edit and undo sepia desaturate takes um, the picture completely to black and white as you see here and what you can do is kinda go and uh, experiment with these different effects. This is an old photo effect. Here we have cross process. Posterize and it has a setting here where you can adjust how the photo looks. Cancel. And Now when you come over here to filter uh, less of these uh, have settings that you can adjust. Uh, one of the more popular ones that you see often is the Hope, which is uh, inspired by the Barack Obama picture that's very popular. And we have Blur, and I'm going to go ahead and edit and undo both of these so you can see them individually. And you have Noise, which also has a setting. like so. I'm just going to show you a few more of these. I just want you to be aware uh, that these exist in Pixlr and that you can achieve uh, a pretty wide variety of different looks with your picture which makes the, um, in my opinion it makes the, the a very fun uh, program to use. I'm going to come down here to heat map, which is fun. It's like seeing the world through the eyes of the predator. If you're seeing everything like a heat seeking missile. Come down here to tritone. Adjust the settings here. back to filter find edges so once you've watched the video you know get back uh, to Pixlr uh, and open a photograph and play with this um, there's a wide variety of different things uh, that you can do I haven't showed you all of them 
Um, I just made this video just to demonstrate a few of the capabilities of Pixlr. Uh, it's a very fun program, and um, I hope you're able to take some of this back and uh, create some or edit uh, some interesting photographs.